It's ironic that people really don't always put the travel insurance or their health insurance at the top of their list when they're traveling. You're concerned about what clothes am I going to wear? I better bring my sinus medication. What hotel am I going to stay at? I better bring some Toms, some antacids. What we find is that about 80% of the individuals who uh, travel abroad don't have international coverage. Everyone that I know that travels, I always tell them, purchase health insurance, purchase travel insurance. If people knew the problems or the things that they might encounter when they travel overseas, they absolutely would purchase health insurance first thing. Many insurance policies stop at the border. What if you're in an area where there's literally no hospital. You know, you may be on an island in the South Pacific. What if you're on a cruise ship and you need to be evacuated? You may be in the middle of Africa. You could be involved in an accident. Tuberculosis, malaria. We don't think about that here in the United States. What if you're not, you know, able to contact a family member right away? There's nothing more devastating than a husband and wife, children on vacation, something happens to one of them, they have to know that a company is there to help them in their time of need. Well, we recognized that there was a need for an insurance administrator that could provide um, private medical insurance for U.S. citizens either living or traveling abroad or for non-U.S. citizens that wanted quality private medical insurance that they could take with them anywhere in the world. Well, in some situations we are the closest thing that they have to a bedside caregiver in some situations because sometimes people are in very remote areas where there is no clinician in sight, not a nurse, not an EMT, not a medical assistant, anyone. We can cover uh, people no matter how they're traveling, wherever they're going, uh, we can provide the coverage for them. All you need to do is to look at the statistics to see how the market has responded to IMG. every element of the insurance business, the policy issued, the premium collection, the claims, the medical case management, evacuation benefits. Some of the unique challenges that we face working in different time zones around the world, different languages, different currencies. A lot of countries don't keep standardized medical records. Sometimes we get a bill on, uh, you know, a brown paper sack um, that may have have been incurred in a hospital in um, Zimbabwe. We work with tens of thousands of brokers throughout the world. They provide not only just the product knowledge, but also the local service. The insured can go to that producer and say, you know, would you check on this for me? And that producer is able to say, sure, I know uh, Jane Doe up at IMG. I'll give her a call. Thank you for calling IMG. How may I help you today? The facilities at IMG have really been designed to have in one location all of the necessary services, staff, and capabilities to provide overseas service to our clients wherever they may be in the world. We don't um, have uh, roadblocks, if you will, uh, that some may have if they don't all operate under the same uh, roof. It's immediate, it's fast, and it's professional. I thank my lucky stars every day I get up and I get to work with such a great and wonderful group of people. This is not a nine to five job. We are worldwide and the world doesn't stop. Well, emergency medical evacuations are the most critical thing we do because these are often life and death situations. We've evacuated people that have been climbing Mount Kilimanjaro. We've evacuated people from the tsunami. We've evacuated people off of pleasure yachts in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Modesty says heroic is too strong a word to use. However, when you talk to some of the insureds that we've assisted, that's exactly the word they do use.
IMG says it has hundreds of people in Haiti covered by its policies. When I drive to work in the morning and I hear something on the news about a major catastrophe somewhere in the world, my first thought is, I wonder if we've gotten any calls. While the Haitian disaster is particularly tough, IMG handles problems like that almost daily. We have countless thank you notes that we receive from people, whether it was from the patient or the family member, about how we help them get through this and get them where they needed to go. We're always looking for new ways to improve our service, our products, to meet the, the needs and the challenges that the world's going to keep throwing at us. At IMG, we really are in the peace of mind business. Yes, it's insurance, but it's us helping people.